shot. <laughs> oh man. <laughs> and welcome to this evening's vlog. This evening. <laughs> I am in old Chinatown. Georgetown, Chinatown. Penang, man. I actually just got up, I've had a snooze all afternoon. I got sunburnt on my, on my ride out and about on my scooter today. Looking for stuff to do. <laughs> so anyway, I'm gonna take you for a tour around old Chinatown. I live in Little India, which is down there about, I don't know, about 500 meters. So I walk up here because it's a lot fresher. And this guy, this is where we have all your street food down here. They're here all day, the start of the morning. These guys have been cooking from this morning. Thank you. Okay, I'm 
happy. I've got some greens. We've had enough of eating rice. I've had enough of spice. Cheers, darling. Yeah. Thank you. You've got me change. Seen Ringgit? Yeah. Give me greens. And I've got. She gave me chopsticks. She didn't give me. She didn't give me a fork. I'm happy. They'll just be greens. Mm. Mm. Fried in garlic with a little bit of soy oyster sauce. I need man, it's some proper grub. There's no sugar in it, which is really good. Mm. I love the little glasses, so I'm happy. Got some greens. Have some proper greens, and this actually, as I said before, actually tastes like lager. Crazy. Oh, that's why that was lemon. Mm. Right, I'll cane this, and then I'll be back out on the streets. Busy little vibrant street, this. It really is. Oh, I got me out on to keep my hair in place. <laughs> well, it was a well-deserved Carlsberg. As it's now, it's now sat there, it's now dark. You alright, darling? You alright? Girls grinning at me, look. They're like, look, what's that weirdo do? Sitting and talking to his box. <laughs> Enjoy your evening. And this guy, where is he? I think he's at nearly everything off the stall. It's good? Yeah, very good. Very good. You have to cook it yourself? Uh, cook it yourself, you put your, your choices. Okay. Uh, found it by, uh, charged by the skewer. Ah, uh, charged by the skewer? Yeah, uh, uh, sitting YouTube. Yes. I'm also sitting YouTube. Oh, you really? Yeah, I have a channel. Oh. Later I show you. Oh, fellow YouTuber? Yeah, from Penang. From Penang? I'm a local. You are? Yeah, we are okay. selling local food. Oh, okay. Yeah. It's good? Yeah. My friend, enjoy your food. Bon appetit. Yes, yes a bon appetit. May, may see you around again. Yes. <laughs> Have a good evening. Night time. It's the right time. <laughs> For me to go walk about. Down this street, as you come out. That little street. All well lit. Having your food and stuff. You alright ladies? <laughs> They're running away. We go, sorry, you want to go that way. So we go down here. Which I would call, I don't know, Tourist Street. This is full of bars. All down here. And, whoa, all down there. <laughs> we go this way first. More food. Good eh? Oh man, what are they cooking? Hello? Hello? Hello, you girl. Oh man. Oh you got some funny music going on there, buddy. Oh man. All looks very interesting. Thank you. Excuse me. <laughs> Wow, there's a queue, look at all these people queuing up. Good day! Hello! Hello! Oh wow, what a bar! Excuse me, thank you. Cheers, buddy. What a wicked looking bar. Oh man. That's classy. Cheers, guys, thank you. It's what? It's cool. It's cool. Cool, thank you. Cheers. <laughs> Oh, Wicked little streets at night. It's a reggae bar. 
<laughs> I know some copy music. How are you, man? You good? You sell marijuana? You have marijuana? <laughs> Not Thailand, man. No. <laughs> what are you cooking up, man? Wow. Ah, Arabic food. Okay. Cheers, guys. Have a good evening. Thank you. <laughs> Oh man, there's a couple of people in there look a bit stale. I tend to get that from Westerners. They get quite stale when there's a when there's a YouTuber about it's funny. But the locals are cool with it. Very good. Another cool little spot. Aha. Uh -huh. Hong Kong bar. Hello, I bet your name's Jenny. I bet, I bet this is one of the oldest bars in town, isn't it, Jenny? And I bet loads of Aussies come here. How are you, darling? You all right? <laughs> I'm coming back, you don't remember me? I was in there last night with the two girls. But I've got yeah. a hat on tonight. Nice yeah, tonight I look good looking. Thanks, Jenny. With the hat, yes. Well, the, girls, right? the girls are cool. I don't know where they are tonight, no. Oh. But no, I'll be back for a drink before I go. Oh, well, I was out till 11. I was out with the two girls till gone 11 o'clock, which is late, late for me. I'm usually in bed by 8. <laughs> this bar actually burned down quite some time ago and it's been rebuilt. And all the Aussies, all the Australian military guys will come in here. It's a really popular bar. And the bar lady is Jenny, and you've had this bar for quite some time. Uh, yeah, yeah your, your ancestors had the bar before you? Yeah. Yeah. Many years ago. Many years ago. And there's bits on here, look, about when it, her ancestors and when it burnt down. And all this military, it's all Australian military. Yeah. Cheers Jenny, I shall see you a little later. Okay. Thank you. Okay. <laughs> yes, I was in the bar last night with two girls all night. And then we went walk about around to another bar around the corner. <laughs> and I was out quite late. Wow, this place, this place looks a bit, that's the out. A bit too classy for me. There is classy here, this is the inn. I don't know if you have to queue up, excuse me, or if you need special invitation. But it looks quite classy. I don't think they'll let me in. <laughs> can I, is it okay to go in and film? Yeah. I can? Yeah. Okay, cheers buddy, thank you. Wicked, excuse me ladies. Thank you, thank you. lovely. What a wonderful looking spot. <laughs> it is classy looking joint. Restaurant. Wow. Good evening. Good evening. Good day. <laughs> and that is the out. Wicked. Nice little garden. Oh man, he's on the hooker. Can I, you don't mind me film? Oh man, look at him on the hubbly bubbly. Wow. Oh man, that smells good. Oh man, cheers buddy. Thank you very much. Oh, cool spot. Lovely space. Cheers, gents. Thank you. Oh, man, lovely spot to spend the evening in there. And over the road there, that was pumping music out last night. Whoa. I will go back and have a, <laughs> have a beer with Jenny a little late. It's a bit quiet in there now. Oh, man, I'm going over there. The Pocock. Pocock? music was that was heaving in there last night when i came out at 11 o'clock to walk home just in here it's a bit quiet at the moment it's pretty good it will be busy but look how cool that place looks wow cheers buddy thank you, thank you all the best fella and then you have right here the gravy baby Play. I'll get away from that music and that place is always busy. Daytime, 
and evening time. And I just walked down this little street because here is where I was last night. <laughs> oh man, with Jen Jenny and Ali, two school teachers. It's cool, and they took me into this bar, into the funk cafe. And here is the guy. How are you, fella? Hey, hi. I was here last night. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah I got my hat on. <laughs> you may not remember me, but uh, it was Ali and Jenny, right? Yeah, 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 yeah cool. Yeah. They're nice ladies. They are, they are, they are. They are really cool. So I'm just doing a little vlog of um, this evening. Uh, yeah, 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 uh, yeah, yeah. But, yes. Yeah. Say something about this place, yeah? I will, I'll come back in a minute. Um, okay, okay. Because um, this is a brothel over here, right? Yeah, no more. <laughs> but the girl said it is, it's still open. No, no, no. no. It's finished? Yeah, it's over. Ah, uh, it's over. <laughs> ah, because I thought it looked a bit... Anyway, but over here, look, this used to be... I'll be back in a minute, for yeah, one yeah, second. Time, huh? Yeah, this used to be an old brothel. And you wouldn't know that. <laughs> you see, it's all a bit run down. If I hadn't spent the evening with those two lovely ladies last night, if you're watching, and uh, thank you for a wonderful evening. But in here was an old brothel. Now you're not going to get many YouTubers telling you a story uh, about old Georgetown and places like that. Now I'm having a little wonder down here, there's things are going a little bit quiet. Just want to see if there's a little bit of artwork because artwork is what georgetown of course is famous for and it is littered and scattered just about everywhere but ah oh man no there's bits of <laughs> these things i'm gonna go back in there and i'll, have, I'll go in and have a beverage and that uh, because that is a really good bar the funk bar and i had a, uh, it was a really good evening there and i also met another guy in there from liverpool last night with his wife from South Africa, <laughs> just showing you all this old turt, look, all littered on the street, these things. Where I've been going around early morning photographing all this stuff. Uh, this is what I've been doing. Isn't that cool? Yes, yeah, so as it gives a guy in there last night, this will blow your mind, right? Can I make this up? Um, the two girls started talking with him, and that is from Liverpool, his lovely wife from South Africa, a really nice couple. And he looked at me and he said, you're a chef. <laughs> You've actually cooked me a meal. That blew me away. And yeah, I had a funny thing was, he said I'd never ever forget a face. And whilst he was in Edinburgh, <laughs> he'd visited a restaurant that I'd worked in and I'd actually cooked him a meal. Um, you can imagine just sitting in that bar like that and someone says, you're a chef. You, it, it blew my mind, it was really funny. But I ended up talking with him and the two girls talked with him as well because he was actually a history teacher. So it was really cool, really cool bar to be right here. So I'm going in, this is the funk. And I sat there last night and got a little bit drunk. So I'm going in, see if we can get over the music. But what a cool bar, what a cool bar. All this cool stuff. <laughs> Cheers buddy, thank you. All that nice artwork. Light air conditioning going on, which is all really good. It's nice, it's fresh. And look at that, another one. I love all these guys. Oh man, and in the back. Oh man. Oh, look at this stuff. Didn't know this was in here. The guy's a bit of a collector. Ah oh, man, look, he's collected all these old cassettes. <laughs> old TV. That was wicked. Let's, oh man, they got vinyl all in here, but look over here, man. Ah, oh, wow, some of this stuff. Look at that. All the, oh man, the heads. Wicked, wicked stuff. And the miniature, oh man, the doll's heads. <laughs> the guy is a collector. How about that? Didn't know this stuff was in here. That's really cool. Right, I'll be back in a minute, guys. I've just got to stop in there and I'm going to have a beer. And another cassette, look. Wicked. Wicked. Vintage everywhere. Really cool to see. Really cool. <laughs> okay, um, these things aren't lit up yet. 
I don't know what time, but these I'm sure. Or are they lit up? <laughs> I'm not sure if they light up, but it's just the shadows from the light. There's another one up here. They're all rather new, but they are littered everywhere. These things. As we end up going down this street. Oh man. Guy there just warming up. Good day. Good day. I'll probably be back there for a beverage. Oh, what another wicked little street down here where you will find cheap hotels, dormitory hotels, homestays, etc. Oh man, here look, there's a bit of dodgy artwork. <laughs> it's not all brilliant. There's some crap artwork as well, look. <laughs> and another hotel down there, but whoa, look. What is happening of an evening in Georgetown? All around here. It's really cool. Wicked little bars. Oh, wow, look at this one. All the neon lights. All the... <laughs> all the old uh, Mexican skulls, look. Wicked. Wicked little spot, a bit trippy looking in there. An outside area. It's all good. It's all good. I was, I was just talking to the guy outside that last bar, the funk bar, about his collections. There is boss's collections, most of them. But he collects stuff as well. But he's told me there is a flea market every morning at the city stadium uh, around about nine o'clock, half nine. So I will be heading there first thing in the morning. I've still got my scooter, which I rented, from here, outside the loft. Oh man, it's a little bit dark down this street. But this is old Penang of a night time. Oh man, there's a cool little spot there. Whoa! Oh, it's an artist shop. It's all looking very good. Have a quick look with Pete. Oh wow. And the artist is at work. It's okay? You don't mind? Oh man, that's lovely. Oh man, hello. That's really cool. This is your shop. Obviously, all your artwork. Oh man, wow. That is really nice. Oh man, all the postcards. Oh mate, that is lovely. Look, these little fridge magnets, I think. A young lady there, hand painting them. Oh man, for our own shop. That's a nice way to spend the evening. Awesome, darling, thank you. All the best, thanks very much. Cool, cool, cool place is old Georgetown. And I'm gonna walk back up this way. You see, it's cool when all the lights come on because I wanna go and film around little India as well because even though it smells of the morning it does look quite cool of an evening so I will walk back this way here is my motorbike rental guy there look for rent I bet he'll rent you just about anything I'll see you in the morning happy can happy can dude where? Where am I going? Oh, he wants me to see his advertising board. Because <laughs> he's got his phone number on it. A scooter man, look, that's what he wants me to film. <laughs> oh, right, and he's got, oh, that one looks new. Huh? I'm so talking to him, sorry, darling. That one looks new. Yeah, same thing. Same, same. I'll see you in the morning, buddy. <laughs> After I've been to the flea market. I'll probably then take the bike back and then I'll end up getting on the bus I guess where I haven't decided to my next destination tomorrow oh man look at it, it's just so picturesque look lovely little garden there to sit out there and chill it's nice it's nice <laughs> good place to be this it's the only one of these that is actually lit up. All the others are not. And this piece of artwork can be found, wait for it, right across the road to the red light area. Wow! 
Is that not red light area? <laughs> Certainly looks like a red light area to me. Don't know. What is all this red light about? I don't know. <laughs> but I saw all these red lights on these buildings when the taxi brought me in. So I don't know what they're all about. I don't know why they're all lit red. You just hang on, because I've got one more little bit I want to do. Just up from the red light area, it's the fire station. And I just asked the fireman on the bike there if I could film, and he said, yeah, it's cool. Because they've got a little bit of artwork, but more to the point, they've got their own little museum in here, look. Wicked bit of artwork. <laughs> awesome. It was old red bike. And I knew he was a fireman because he's wearing the uniform. Another fireman there. Wicked little, little. Oh man, look at these. Oh mate, these are awesome. <laughs> the model done in the resin. Look at that with the divers. Wicked. Superb. Superb little. These are called dioramas. And they are superb. Little crash incident. Fireman on scene. Your truck has turned over. Look. Spilt up all the oil to clean it up. It's awesome. I love a diorama. I really do. I really do. What a wicked, wicked little spot. Oh man, look. Look at all your Lego men. <laughs> that is superb. That's really good to see. That really is. And more. All the little uniforms. Right here in the fire station. That was cool, cool, cool stuff. All the machinery and tools used. Wicked, really is wicked. Nice to see. That <laughs> look with the ladder. That was a lovely bit of artwork. Really blends in with the fire going on at the top. Really does blend in with the whole environment of Georgetown which I have enjoyed, I really have. This is the crossroads of Georgetown, right here. <laughs> so you go that way, from where I've just been, to Chinatown, on this side of the crossroads, and then that way to Little India, on this side of the crossroads as I am drawn towards well it's the evening prayer I guess no. <laughs> and like I say this is little India and it is a nice atmospheric feeling and a place to be of an evening it's wicked the mosque right there Now when I first got here my first night, I thought there was a guy up there singing. But no, it's loudspeakers. I think, I think it is what is played uh, all over. So these guys just hanging about for customers. <laughs> having a doze, isn't he? Just having a little... What would you call a little little nap? It's really quiet on this side of the street, apart from apart from that. But like I say, it's all really nice, well lit, all on these back streets, and it's all around these streets that you're gonna find. I keep talking about artwork, but I kind of forgot where they are. I think uh, I am. I'll just keep walking. Got to keep an eye on the battery. Oh man, the battery's getting really low, really low. Wow, because I want to head just over this place where all the rickshaw corner is, where you can rent electric scooters and stuff. Which is just over here. This little street, so I want to hurry this up a little bit. Oh man. Yes, right here, this is more or less. Again, you've got nice hotel boutique hotels 
residents. And you can rent these scooters or bikes, electric from these guys. I don't know how much they are, but they're all in there to be rented. And also all these rickshaws. They're all, this is what I call rickshaw corner. So you can rent one of these and get a guy to rickshaw you about all, t all around. Wicked Chinese hotel, mixture of new and old, right there. And there's more, another mosque down there. And as we walk down this little bit of a street, I'm hoping that we're going to get a bit of artwork on this tour. <laughs> there's another bit of that, but it's not really what I'm looking for. Is. these streets are cool I was walking oh man here's the little umbrella street <laughs> all pretty popular uh -huh. and there's a little bit of, that's Elvis I filmed him the other day didn't I in the, in the daytime Elvis on this street of umbrellas that's lit up with an evening and it's really cool oh and these guys you would have seen me on here of the morning wouldn't you giving him a push Cheers fella, thank you. And there is a few more little bits of artwork down the street. Guy doing fresh juice, fresh shake. Cheers buddy. There is just a little bit more at night down here. And I'll nip back down and I'll quickly turn left. Oh man, they say it's just nice. It is just nice. It's not too well lit and it's not too dark. It's just right. For that atmospheric kind of feeling as you look around it is just awesome looking it's just cool cool place and it doesn't all i can smell this evening is joysticks <laughs> which is a lot better than what i smelt on my morning walk all very good all very good people on electric scooters everywhere. Good evening. That's a nice bit of artwork. This guy, look. I think he's shouting good day. <laughs> right there. Good day. <laughs> awesome. Wow. My head's getting sweaty. This is old old India Penang. It's amazing how many people there are not around. It's so quiet and peaceful. There's no traffic. Hardly any traffic. And it's just a wicked back street. Just sit and chill. No alcohol. Oh, no alcohol. It's under 21s. No smoking. Which is already good. Cool, another touristy little shop there, renting electric scooters. How, how much is one of these for a day, darling, to rent? For one hour, for 25 ringgit for one hour. Okay, thank you. Thank you. They wouldn't run for, now they wouldn't have the power, now for just one hour, 25, okay. Thank you very much. Oh, well, there you go. If you wanna hire one of them for an hour, scoot all about here, 25 ringgit. Man, which is really cool. And we have like we've got another little bit of cool stuff. Oh man. As <laughs> I can't be end of the street if I turn left. Oh man. That would be me back to my apartment. And this piece of artwork is probably the most famous piece of artwork here. Right there. The most well known. And I'm gonna sit right there for this. Oh man, we got it in as a thumbnail. Are we in? A stretch right out. So guys, as always, appreciate you tuning in. Thanks for watching. And until next time, au revoir.